some of the first dealers that we started to do to deal with, one of them was the Toronto Folklore Center on Avenue Road. He was pretty well the first one commercially that bought the guitars from us. Then on a trip out west, uh, we met David Cahill in, uh, in Victoria, and he became a dealer in uh, 72, which is a long, long time ago. And there were other people in Montreal, Rufus Guitar Shop, they, they bought guitars. And finally afterwards, it, it kind of shifted more into Europe because my guitars were suitable uh, because of the design and just the way it was. We ended up selling a lot of guitars in, to the European market. In the early 70s, we had uh, Keith Music from Vancouver here. They became our distributor, our worldwide distributor, and they, they did a really fine job. You know, they, they opened up Italy for me, they opened up Germany, they opened up many countries, okay? Because they were, Fred, Fred Keefe was doing a lot of, of marketing for us, and that lasted several years. And uh, that opened the market and the guitar was well received. <laughs>